Many farmers have had to diversify to survive. You'll have heard of farm shops, farms having campsites, car boot sales, even theatre on a farm. But I've come to experience film on a farm. Farming and movies don't usually go hand in hand, so how did the idea germinate? Sat on a tractor, bored one harvest and fed up of having to go to London to do anything through a love of film and the great outdoors, outsprung film on a farm. The, the aim very much is to expand the business, frankly, across the UK and looking at franchise opportunities. So this gives quite a nice idea as, a, as an entry level young farmer, whatever, looking to diversify from the core farming business. But bringing Hollywood to a farm is not cheap. Our biggest cost actually is our film licensing. So we have to pay 40% of our ticket revenue to the UK licensing board, which really, really squeezes our business very, very hard. Film on a Farm launched last year with just one weekend. It went so well that this year there are 10 events over the summer showing favourite films like Mamma Mia, Lion King, Grease, and tonight it's Top Gun. It's a very novel and interesting idea. And Top Gun, one of your favourites? I've never seen it before, so this is a first for me. Yeah, I know. That's a really big deal. You've never seen yeah. Top Gun? Yeah, so I'm looking forward to it, yeah. i uh, seen Tom Cruise again. He was my first crush when I saw it many, many years ago. So, uh, yeah, and coming out, good night out with the girls. Oh, it's being at one with nature, isn't it? And just enjoying the British countryside and, yeah, it's great. And then it was time to sit back under the stars and enjoy this Hollywood classic.